Hello, so guys. Today I'm going to show you how you can split screen play on your Xbox Series S, X, and also the Xbox One. So here I have a controller. Here I have another one. So I have two controllers right now. And what we are going to do is, first off, what you want to do is your second controller. You want to make sure that you connect. So my controller is quite black. So what you want to basically do is hold on on the button right over here. So there's like a but little black button right over here and then once you do that you want to also do it on your xbox so just press on that little black button right over there and once you do that it should be able to connect so now once you're done with that guys what you want to basically do is you just want to go ahead and add a guest account so let's go ahead and add a new guest account or we can add a real account so go through to add or switch on here if you add a guest account guys what will happen basically is that all of the data and all of the progress made on that guest account will not be saved but if you add a new account on here all of the data and progress will be saved because this is basically a, like an account and on here like everything like let's just say that you're playing call of duty right and you add a guest account what will happen is it will just start at level one but if you add a new account, it will also start at level one. But the uh, next time that you play a split screen, you will actually have uh, an option to like, let's just say that you got into like level five, then you will start off as level five. So it will basically be saved. So let's go over to a game like, let's go over to Modern Warfare 3. By the way, guys, if you please could like and subscribe, thank you so much. It doesn't matter if, it, if it's like Xbox 360 games, so it works in every game. It doesn't really matter. Let's click on here. Start. So let's go over to multiplayer. Okay, so let's go over to. Okay, I'm not even French. <laughs> Can we add an account here? I, I don't even know French. I need to change the language, by the way. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back. I think it was this. This was split screen, I think. So yeah, this was a spread screen. So basically, let's just press on A and then on your other controller. So your friend also press A once he connects or she. So you will see two accounts like you see over here. And also, by the way, guys, if you have some trouble connecting your new controller, you say USB-C uh, controller, I mean USB-C to connect with your Xbox. So if you connect it with your cable dry, uh, directly to your Xbox, it will just directly connect. And then you can also remove the cable out of your Xbox and just continue on playing. So if you have some problem, uh, a problem like with uh, connecting, it's because I actually had that problem. And yeah, this is how you can basically play split screen, guys. It's really that simple. And then you can basically start. And like you see over here, let's start. And like you see, guys, you can just basically play. That's how you can do it. And I don't have basically friends with them. So yeah, this was the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a like, subscribe. And also, I want to show you this. Uh, let's go over to home. So you can join the Airfix community if you have some problems. And also, if you want to turn off your controller, what you want to do is you just want to hold on on your Xbox home button, go for it to turn off controller. And once you press it, it will basically directly turn off. And then you can just play on your other controller. So you don't have to wait till the other controller just turns off. So thanks for watching guys. Please leave a like, subscribe and take care.